It isn't often we have a live guest on the Michigan Replay Show with Bo Schembechler, but with Anthony Carter, we felt we just couldn't get away from it. Anthony, welcome, first of all. And secondly, did you think all this was going to happen to you when you came to Michigan from Riverary Beach, Florida? Well, no, I didn't. I, when I first was being recruited by Coach McCartney, you know, he told me that, um, you know, a guy coming from Florida, that uh, there's no way that I would play, wouldn't play with, you know, my talent. And that's all I wanted to do, basically, was to play. And, uh, you know, leaving the state of Florida was a big adjustment, you know, for me, and it's something that I had to get used to, and I think I did. Bo, getting used to uh, Michigan from Florida, how about you getting used to Anthony? Oh, that wasn't hard. To, <laughs> uh, I got used to him real quick the first time we... Uh, we practiced in shorts, um, threw a few bombs out there, and all of a sudden I see this guy uh, running underneath him and catching balls that I thought were not catchable. And I knew right then that Anthony and I would become great friends. <laughs> Anthony, in your first game against Northwestern, you returned a punt all the way when you were a freshman, I think 78 yards or something like that. When did you realize that something special was going to happen at Michigan for you? Well, after that punt return, I came back in, uh, I think in the fourth quarter it was, and uh, Wayne's hit me again on a quick slant pattern, and, and then I scored again. And that was two touchdowns as a freshman, and I thought, wait, hey, this is going to be fun, you know. <laughs> and then the next game came Notre Dame. We had him at home again, and uh, I ended up on a punt return, and then I fumbled that one, and then I said, wow, this is how you're going to be again. And, and that was kind of rough for me, that Notre Dame game. But over and all, I thought that everything, you know, came my way. It certainly did, and everything came Anthony's way. And one of the things that makes him so special are some of the great catches he made. So we made a special Michigan Replay section up on Anthony, and we call it an anthology of Anthony over his four years at Michigan. Anthony, when you see those things and the catches you, you made and the things you do, does it surprise you when you watch them on film? Well, yeah, it does, but it seems to happen all in practice, too, you know. So when it, when it happens in practice, you know, it, you, coach always say you, you play like you practice, and it, and it pays off in the game, too. If you had to characterize your career at Michigan, the four years you've spent here, what would you say? Well, I would say that here in Michigan, you know, the people are nice, the coaching staff are nice, and it's just one place that I, I think I'll never forget at Michigan, and uh, I just will hope more success for the team, you know, when I'm not there, and uh, I'll be with them 100%. And Bo, he's a special part of the Michigan program, isn't he? Because really he's been a banner carrier for the four years he's been here. What a great player. Well, uh, the, the important thing is um, the enormous talent that we all know he has, but his contribution to the team is also just as great by uh, being a good guy. And the combination is what really helps. You know, you can be the great star and not be a solid uh, character individual, and it doesn't have the impact on the team. But Anthony has been well-liked by his teammates. He's been voted most valuable player once. He was elected captain. 
He's just been an outstanding all-around player. And sadly enough, Anthony's only got one more game to play for Michigan, but that'll be a dandy in the Rose Bowl. Thanks very much for being with us.